American Apparel, the struggling clothing brand known for its controversial advertising and founder, has a new deal to shore up its finances. This represents a big change in leadership and some badly needed money. Retail reporter Elizabeth Harris on the brand's future, now on the New York Times Minute. The company, known for its provocative imagery and made in America manufacturing, has been plagued by bad numbers. The company has been losing money for years. In the last three fiscal years, they lost a total of $270 million. Now, a deal with New York investment firm Standard General provides a $25 million cushion, but it does put the hedge fund in ultimate control. Standard General also demanded a leadership change that includes a remade board, which notably does not include the company's founder. Five of the seven board members are going to have to resign, and an investigation that the board started into the founder, Dove Charney, is going to continue. Last month, Mr. Charney was ousted as chief executive after allegations of personal and professional misconduct. It's not yet clear if Mr. Charney will have continue to have any role as an executive at the company. The new board will get to decide whether he stays or goes. Going forward, the company remains committed to keeping its manufacturing in the United States, a rarity in the garment industry. But will the deal allow American Apparel to reclaim its cool factor, or will it just provide some short-term stability? They have some serious long-term challenges, so um, you know this could be a start. But we'll see. It's really too early to tell at this point.